Alright everybody, thank you for coming back to the channel. Today on the internet, we're gonna look at the iOS 14 concept. This is made by Concepts iPhone. Okay, now Concepts iPhone, let me give you a little history here. The history is that they're amazing, okay? Their concepts are through the roof good. Like, they look like the real thing, you know? Their videos look like they could actually be videos released by Apple. They're, they're fantastic. This actually came out about a week ago, this concept here. The iOS 14 concept, the video is called Meet iOS 14 Apple. And it's by, again, Concepts iPhone. I'll leave a link to their YouTube channel down in the description so you can go check them out. But they are really fantastic. So let's see uh, what we got here. We're going to watch through it. And uh, I'm just going to talk a little bit about it. So let's check it out. Okay. Okay, so let's stop right there. First of all, these are some really huge things. The fact that the call interface does not take up the full screen, that's huge, okay? The fact that you can get a call there on your lock screen and, and you can choose to ignore it without declining the call, without accepting the call, you could still go into your iPhone, still do things, even as they're waiting for you to pick up in the background, that's fantastic and that needs to happen. Let's keep watching the video here. Okay, camera conversion tra translation, that's great. Oh good, traffic, okay, great. AR to Apple Maps. Oh good, we've got some tool, it looks like control center there, but a little bit different. Measure level calc, better. Oh good, bringing the sound app to iPhone, that's big. Compass. Oh my gosh. Being able to adjust camera settings in the camera app, why is this not a, like literally, why is this not a thing? <laughs> like, you're kidding, like that is the basic design of an app, like being able to control, especially on the camera. You wanna switch from 4K to 1080, you can't do that without going into the settings on your iPhone. This absolutely needs to happen, so I'm glad that this, this is added into the concept here. Beautiful. Oh, cool. A horizon line of video. That's huge. Mail looks like reminders. Cool. Adding your signature through Face ID. That's brilliant. List view on the iPhone. Notifications look a lot better. Good, widgets, way improved. Siri, okay, the fact that Siri does not take up the whole screen in this iOS 14 concept is monumental, okay? How many times do you need to use Siri to call a number, for example, okay? I've had this several times where I need to use Siri to call a number that I see on my phone. I have to memorize the number because once I start summoning Siri and say, hey, call this number, it's, Siri is, taking up the whole screen and I can't see what the number is anymore. I've had this several times. Now I know what you're gonna say. Well, typically you can just click the link and number will show up as a link and it'll call. It doesn't always show up as a link. If you're looking at an image, for example, let's say you take a picture of a phone number that somebody gives you, you take a picture of it and you wanna call that number, you literally cannot call the number while seeing the number at the same time. That's a big deal. That's a huge flaw. Because if you want to go to the phone app, you can, and this is what I'll typically do, even though it's frustrating me so bad. You can go to the phone app, start typing it in, go back to the, the photos app, look at what the number is, type in the next few digits. Or the other option is, which is what I, this is actually what I usually do, is quickly try to memorize the number. It's kind of a fun game, I guess, but that's not how iOS should be. You should not have to play games to make your phone work. I just want to be able to say, Siri, call this number, one, da-da-da-da-da, 
and see it there on the screen and Siri comes down from the top. Siri, there is no reason why Siri needs to take up the whole screen. Maybe there is in like a phone memory management reason. Like, I don't know, maybe it seems ridiculous, but maybe there's some sort of thing where there's like not enough RAM to like show Siri and the other application at the same time. But Siri needs to just come down from the top of the iPhone. That, that needs to happen. There's no reason why Siri needs to be taking up the whole screen. Apple, do what you need to do. Give us a thicker phone if you need to. Siri should not be taking up the whole screen. That's, that's ridiculous. So that's a huge part of this concept. Okay, fantastic. That is awesome. That's really, really great. I'm really excited about the iOS 14 concept. I think that that looks fantastic. Great work. Again, to concept iPhone, especially I think that the main things from that video were AR on Apple Maps. I think that Siri coming down from the top, not taking up your whole screen. And the same thing about the phone interface. It should not take up your whole screen. I think that those three things are probably the biggest changes we'd see uh, to iOS 14. I hope that there are bigger ones that Apple has in store, new features, for example, rather than just improvements on things that honestly should have been there all along. I understand maybe that they weren't in the first original iPhone. I understand maybe that they weren't in the iPhone 3G and 3GS. The fact that they're not in the iPhone 12 Pro, that you're really pushing it. Love Apple, love the innovation. Um, that's something that needs to change. And so remember to like and subscribe down below because that's really gonna help me out, guys. And lastly, make sure to tune back in tomorrow for another video. Okay, thanks so much, you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace.